head to AutoDS, click on settings, then we're going to click on the templates tab. And here we have all of our templates. What you want to do is add a blank template here on top, give it a name, for example, my new template, and click on create. And as we can see here, my new template, I'm going to click on edit to open up the editor. And what I want to do here is paste all of the code that I got from my freelancer. So in this case, let me show you the file that I got from one of the freelancers that I work with. So as I mentioned, you're going to get a code file. This is the code that you want to paste inside. But first, let me show you the HTML file that I got that will show you what my template is going to look like once I add that code inside. So I'm going to double click on the HTML file. So here's the template that I got from my freelancer. As you can see, it looks nice and clean. My product's title is going to be here. The image will be here, the main image. The product's description will be written here along with the product's features. And I've also got my shipping statement, my shipping policy, my warranty and returns, who we are, contact us and so forth. And of course, a couple of trust badges, which I talked about. All right, so now let's open up the code file that I actually need to paste in order to get that template to work on my store. So here's that note file. And as you can see, it's just a whole bunch of letters and numbers. You don't really need to understand anything here. Just highlight all of the text and of course, copy it. Then on the right side, I'm going to click on source to let the system know that this is an HTML code. And I'm going to paste the code right over here. Now I'm going to unclick on source. And as you can see, the template loaded up really easily and in just one second after pasting down the HTML source code. You can continue editing the text right here. It doesn't have to be in HTML, it can be in live, like right here, an exchange of the product instead of item. So you can completely turn around what your freelancer did, edit around the text and do whatever you want to make this eBay template the most professionally made for your eBay store. Now, if you do not want to set aside a budget for your eBay template, you really don't have to. You even have free templates from using AutoDS. Let me show you what I mean and where that's at. So I'm going to go back to AutoDS. We'll close this custom template that we just created. And on the left side, instead of my templates, my own custom made templates, I'm going to click on AutoDS templates, eBay. Here I've got a whole bunch of free templates that I can use right off the bat. And that is all there is to it. So as you can see here, we've got nonstop China. We've got Black Friday. We've got Halloween. We've got ready templates for all of these holidays coming up. As you can see here, as I just mentioned, Black Friday, Halloween sale, and Merry Christmas. We've also got for other occasions like Valentine's Day, or if you just want to have a general template for free, like this one, everything for your store, let me just click on preview so you guys can really get a much better glance at this. So all you need to do is click on preview on your templates to see what it will look like. And here, as you can see, everything for your home improvement in one place. So if you've got a home improvement niche, this is the right template for you. As you can see, we've got nice hover effects. And once again, all of this is 100% for free. You don't have to pay anything as long as you have an AutoDS subscription. You can use these eBay templates no hassle and no worries. And of course, you can assign each template to any listing that you want or assign one template to all of your listings by simply clicking on settings. And under your store settings, click on the supplier that you want to apply this rule to. For example, I'm going to select it for my eBay USA store on all of my Amazon US products. As you can see here on the right side, we have default template. And here you can choose whatever template you want to use for all of your listings that will come from eBay USA, from Amazon US as a supplier and eBay USA as your selling channel. So we can click on AutoDS templates and let's say we want to go with Black Friday sale 24 hours. This is a template that we want to have until Black Friday is over. And then when Black Friday is over, we're going to use a different template. Maybe we'll move from there to Christmas already and start preparing our, our stores for Christmas. So that is all you have to do to set a default template. And of course, you can apply different templates to different listings one, one by one. For example, here, I'm going to click on drafts to get to some of my products. Then I'll open the item editor for one of them. I'll click on the descriptions tab. And here I can choose a different template for just this product, this Bluetooth speaker. So I can use the free AutoDS templates. I can use templates that I uploaded manually, like from getting from a freelancer. I can choose to do whatever I want. And that is one of the best things when you combine eBay templates and AutoDS together. Now let's talk about how we can customize and edit our templates. Even though I showed you a small example just about a minute ago, let's head back to the settings page and to our AutoDS templates. So I click on settings, I'm going to click on templates. Now let's say we want to start from scratch and create our 100% own unique template. So what I'm going to do is click on my templates. Then I'm going to click right here on add a bl blank template, just like we did before. Only this time, call it bl blank template. 
Only this time, we won't be pasting a source HTML code that we got from our freelancer. We'll actually just be creating it ourselves. So what I'm going to do here, this is the blank template. I'm going to click on edit. And once again, we are starting right here from scratch. So everything here is blank. Now we've got some triggers up here. You can automatically insert the product's title. So I'm going to click on it. And as you see here, we've got title in a little bit of code, product's description. You can add your store name and we'll just make it look a little bit better by adding a space so we'll know what we're seeing. So the product's title, the description, the store's name, and you can also add your own text like shipping and warranty. And of course, start using the text editor to make it look nice, like making it in bold, making the letters a little bit bigger, adding some colors to it. You can completely play around and make it as fully customizable as you need it to be. Then when you are finished, you've got the preview button. So we're going to click on that and see how our template came out so far. Now I didn't do too much, but AutoDS will show you a random product inside your custom made template to show you how your template is going to look if you continue with what you did so far. So that is how simple it is to create your own template and you don't even need to have any coding skills for that. Now, in order to edit your templates, like I showed you before, it's actually really, really simple. Just keep in mind that you cannot edit AutoDS's templates but you can definitely edit your own custom-made templates or the ones that you uploaded. 